Reconciliation is acknowledging our past through education and understanding. Reconciliation is about listening to us and the First Nation people. Reconciliation is accepting the um, uh, Uluru Statement from the Heart. Reconciliation is about taking a step back. It's about recognising people um, have so many incredible skill sets and allowing space for their voices to be heard. Uh, Reconciliation Week is a chance for us to confront our history but also celebrate the possibilities for our future. Reconciliation Week is not just a week. It is a reminder of the work that we need to do every day. It is an opportunity to stop and listen and move forward together. Reconciliation is when we put a stop to racism in this country. Reconciliation is saying no more to racism. Reconciliation is when we put an end to inequality. Guiding things and looking after people and being together as a reconciling for everyone, young and old. How is our past through education and understanding? For non-First Nations people, we need to make sure that we're there listening, supporting, respecting the rights of our First Nations people. Reconciliation begins with us. It's time that Australians say no more to high incarceration rates of First Nations people. It's really important that from here on in, Australians uh, really respect and value our culture properly by listening, understanding, but not taking over. And my, I place my faith and you know, my trust in the next generation to be able to do that properly because while you didn't have anything to do with what happened in the past, you have the responsibility to fix it so that it's better in the future. Reconciliation is about the First Nation people to be heard on how they can do it. Reconciliation is about coming together but accepting that maybe the blame isn't on others, the blame is on ourselves and we need to look back and figure out what we can do to fix that. Reconciliation is more than just a word, it requires action and that action is us as a country saying the time is now for all Australians to recognise our colonial past and the injustices of past policies that have denied First Nations people their basic human rights and inflicted so much damage upon families. We must acknowledge our past to move forward. It is our time as non-First Nations people to learn, to seek out information and to know the truth of our history.